Today I would like to introduce to you a movie which only needed 5 weeks to reach the top 10 of Polish best films after 1989. The movie Gods, directed by Łukasz Palkowski, is a portrait of a Polish doctor, Professor Zbigniew Relika, who was famous both in the country and around the world. He is an exceptionally important person in Silesia, where since 1984 he had been the head of the cardiosurgical clinic in Zabrze. Gods is a half-private, half-professional history of Zbigniew Relika, who is the best well-known Polish cardiac surgeon. In the movie, we can watch the development of Religa's career from the very beginning to the first successful heart transplant, as well as his and the hospital staff's effort to build the cardiosurgical clinic with all the failures and successes involved. From the point of view of modern people, it will be absolutely abstract that trying to perform the first heart transplant, the doctors had to face people's reluctance. But the history is set in the mid-80s when people still thought that the heart houses the soul. The movie title was inspired by the anecdote, which was once popular in the Polish media. A group of young doctors wanted to visit a club, but the guard didn't want to let them in and asked them, who are you? And they answered, we are gods. In the movie, there are three characters worth mentioning. The first one is Zbigniew Religa, who was born in 1938 and died in 2009. Having graduated from university, he went to USA to do an internship. After that, he worked at Warsaw Cardiosurgical Clinic and since 1984, he had been the head of the cardiosurgical clinic in Zabrze, which is called Silesian Center for Heart Diseases in Zabrze today. In this clinic, in November 1985, Religa managed to perform the first heart transplant. For many years, Religa had also been engaged in politics. He was a same deputy, a senator and a minister of health. The second interesting character is Andrzej Bohenek, a graduate of the Medical University of Silesia in Katowice, who was Religa's deputy. He established the first academic clinic of the Medical University of Silesia. He was married to a famous Polish journalist, Krystyna Bohenek, who lost her life in the plane crash near Smolensk. The third remarkable character is Marian Zembala, who was a very young man when he started working at Religas clinics in Zabrze. He also was a member of the staff who performed the first heart transplant in Poland. In 2015, he served as a Minister of Health. What's interesting, Marian Zembala and Andrzej Bohenek played in the movie, not themselves, but the members of medical board who analyzed the possibility of performing heart transplant. Another interesting fact is that the scene in which they take part was recorded on the 5th of November 2013, which was the 28th anniversary of the first heart transplant in Poland. Also, one of the most important pictures in the history of world photography is connected with the first heart transplant. National Geographic acknowledged the picture in which Zbigniew Religa is sitting by the patient's bed after the surgery and in the corner young Zembala is sleeping as one of 100 most important shots in the history. You surely know that not only internal, but also external organs can be transplanted. The greatest surprise for me uh, was that you can transplant the whole face. The movie, which is connected with this fact, was directed by Małgorzata Szumowska in 2017, and it is called Twarz, Mug. It tells the story of the first face transplant. The movie was awarded a Silver Bear Award at Berlinale. I really recommend watching Gods because of outstanding acting, great music and gripping plot, which is based on real events. I hope you will enjoy the screening and I hope to hear you soon.